Hi, I'm joined now by Pat Bongers, uh, Chair of our Rotary Youth Exchange Program. Welcome, Pat. Thank you, Gord. So tell us a little bit about Rotary Youth Exchange. What is it all about? Well, it's an exchange program that is uh, sponsored by our district in Rotary, and it gives the opportunity for high school kids, age 16 to 17 normally, to spend some time abroad on, on a program where they uh, uh, get to live and go to school in another country. And um, it's, it's, it really is a great program. It, they, they have to start by learning the language because it's normally with a, a, a country that has a different language than, than English. Wow. So that's a bit of a challenge. Um, and they, they, they get involved in the local community just like, just like okay. a resident would. Uh, they get billeted by families over there and um, live and go to school in that community and, and it's a great experience for them. Well, that sounds fantastic. Now, yeah. how long are they over there? Like two weeks, three weeks? <laughs> no, it's, it's close to a year. It's, a it's year. usually, yeah, 10 and wow. a half, 11 months. Wow. It really takes that long for them to really immerse themselves into another country, another culture. Yeah. Um, it really is, it's, it's, they learn so much, but it does, it does take that time. And then we also have an inbound exchange from not necessarily that country, but another country. So okay. we do that same, uh, same sort of process over here. Wow. Yeah. So what, what uh, countries have, uh, have where we have received students? Where have we mostly received students European from? Mostly European countries. Okay, um, yeah. Yes, mostly European countries. Nice. And uh, s sometimes uh, some South American countries are involved in Taiwan uh, the odd time as well. Isn't that neat? Yeah. So for one of our students, uh, like 16, 17, so a high school student, yes. yep. uh, if they were interested in this type of an opportunity where they're spending a year abroad in some country out there, which mm -hmm. is awesome, uh, what is the process in which they uh, go through to get involved with that? There's an application, mm -hmm. and uh, I will be at the high mm -hmm. school soon, or they can reach out to me directly. Um, and, and they fill out an application, and we interview the applicants and p pick the successful candidate. There is some cost, there's a flight cost and some insurance. Um, so there is some cost, but Rotary covers a lot of the cost. There's a lot of programs that they, um, weekends away that the leadership sort of weekends they go, they meet all the other students from all the other wow. countries. And they really make friends from many countries around the world. So the, the cost is relatively minor, I think, compared to what, what the student will get out of the year. Um, but they can certainly contact me for uh, more information on that. Um, so when they use the term exchange, you're not talking just about, you know, exchanging a student. They're talking about exchange of culture, exchange mm -hmm. of family values, exchange mm -hmm. of, the, of everything that's going on in that country, that whole dynamic. Yeah, and it's such a great learning opportunity. And, you know, I've seen students come back after they're 10, 11 months away. And I don't want to say they're a different person. They're the same person, but they certainly have grown so much. Um, they may have a different perspective on you know, life, or they may not, but they've certainly grown, matured, had an experience that I think they'll take with them for the rest of their lives, really. Um, it's really that powerful. Um, I also want to mention that when we're hosting students here, we're looking for host families. Mm. Many times those host families are Rotarians, but they don't have to be. So if someone is out in the community that is interested in being a host family for maybe a three-month period or so, that... Um, they should contact us and, and it's a great opportunity for them as well to host someone from another country. Well, I think that's great. And, and from what a, my own personal experience as a Rotarian here in Gravenhurst, we've hosted uh, uh, Italy and we've hosted, uh, was it Denmark, another one that yes, we had yeah, as well? Yeah, Denmark. And I mean, the great opportunity for that is that we as Rotarians can share in that exchange too, mm -hmm. taking them out on different events within our own area as well. It really works both ways, yeah. So is there any final, final things you'd like us in the viewing audience to know about the Rotary Youth Exchange? Well, I just, I guess if you are of that age or have a, a son or daughter that, that is of that age, just look into it. Um, at the high school, you can ask the guidance counselor and um, I will certainly get more information to them so that they can decide whether it's right for them. Great, thanks so much, Pat. I really okay, appreciate thanks, your help, yeah.